Hello lovelies! I have not made a video in such a long time so it feels really nice to be able to do this and keep in touch with you guys because it's been months? No, yeah, potentially months since I've sat down. So hi, how are you all doing? Please leave comments below. Um, I'm so sorry that I've been a bit out of it. There are several reasons, mostly just to do with time and running a house of two small children who are on a mission to destroy everything at all times. That sounds really bad, <laughs> but it's, it is hard work. They have so much energy and they don't like being stuck indoors, so we're out a lot, which means I can't be at home filming videos. And when we're in, I'm doing laundry, so. But I do have loads of video ideas coming up for the new year, so please stick around. And um, if you haven't yet subscribed, push the subscribe button below. I just thought I would make a quick video to check in with you guys um, and let you know that nothing's wrong or like major has happened. I haven't got loads of time at the moment um, with in between school runs and laundry, so what a glamorous life I lead. <laughs> Another reason why I haven't been on camera, and I've been so reluctant to say this because it's gonna sound so ridiculously vain, but I don't mean it like that. As you can see on my face, I have some acne, which just after a year of having Ezra, my skin broke out into all these little lumps under my skin and I've no idea why I think um, a year after having Ezra I probably had like two pregnancies worth of hormones to just catch up on and so it's just gone mental and also my hair has been falling out which is just ridiculous that might be to do with my anemia though but my skin I've no idea I know it's hormones because it's they're like big hard ones under the skin and then loads of little bumpy ones so um I went to my GP and she basically told me there was nothing she could do because I can't go on the pill because I get migraines so she said I can um go on antibiotics but I just I'm so reluctant I don't feel very peaceful about going on antibiotics because she said if you haven't tried it for four months you haven't tried it which four months of antibiotics I would have like thrush beyond belief and have an upset tummy for four months so I'd rather have acne than that <laughs> so um, the plan at the moment is to just try as many like natural things as I can to try and help help it go away and I have got like cracked down on my skin routine and bought lots of like natural vegan products to try and just clear it all up and not use much chemicals and see if that helps which it really has been helping yes so I'm gonna do a video on like beauty top picks of the month that I've been using to try and help acne so I'm probably not gonna call it that it's not very catchy so um, I will do that shortly in terms of how we're doing living here and like how we've been recently, um, we've been so much better. I think another thing why I haven't vlogged is not that it's all about being perfect on camera, but um, things just, since we've moved here, some of the things that we have experienced have been like the hardest yet in our marriage and in our time as parents. I think we're just in a, in a difficult, nothing may just happen, we've just been in a bit of a difficult phase of life. And if you are a parent of young kids, you will know that it's really hard work. And when you've left your support network, which we did in Bath, and you have to start all from scratch where everybody else has their support networks in place already, and you're coming into that and trying to start all over, all over again, it's really hard. So that has been a bit of a difficult thing for us but it's getting so much better we are really starting to make friends and um yeah just be a bit more at peace with the decision like we never regretted moving here but it just takes a long long time to adjust um especially moving from somewhere like bath which is beautiful to south london which is less beautiful <laughs> Um, and so yeah, Saxon and Ezra, they're really the stars of the show that you all want to know about. Saxon and Ezra are doing really, really well. Um, Ezra is talking so much at the moment, it's amazing. He is just like adorable, he's the happiest kid ever. Um, he's also quite cheeky. He's got a really like cheeky streak to him. He is so cheeky, it's hilarious. 
very sweet, very happy baby. Saxon is loving preschool and um, actually I say that, he doesn't want to go every morning but, <laughs> but when he's there he's fine and he does enjoy it and he's really into like imagination play at the moment which is really fun, I love this stage. So yeah, the, the boys are doing really well. Saxon last night though, bless him, he wasn't feeling very well, he said I think I need to go to bed and he went upstairs and got himself in bed, he had jeans and a jumper on and the light was on, <laughs> he went into his room and fell asleep. Moments like that, I wish I vlogged like daily. I just, I wanna capture all these moments, but I just don't have the time to edit all the videos and upload them every single day. So um, I'm, I am not gonna be doing Vlogmas. I might do something like Vlogmosmas. <laughs> I just wanna say, if you're new to this channel, thank you so much for joining us. I feel so privileged to have like nearly 300 subscribers and you're all lovely um, and I am looking forward to just being involved more with Channel Mum stuff, covering some of their topics for you all. And yeah, thank you so much for watching. I will see you guys really, really soon. Mwah.